So today's video is going to be a jelly sandwich tutorial. I almost didn't do a tutorial on this because it is so easy. I mean, it's so simple and I don't want you guys to think that I'm like thinking you're stupid and I have to show you how to do this. So many of you asked me for it. That didn't even make sense. So many of you asked me for this, so I'm doing it. It is insanely simple. All you need is a jelly polish and a glitter glittery type of polish and you will be good to go and a good top coat. The basic premise of a jelly sandwich is you're sandwiching glitter in between your jelly polish. So two coats of your jelly polish, one coat of glitter and then one more coat of jelly polish and you're done. Top coat that baby and it is smooth sailing. I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. I'm working on my middle finger in the tutorial. Sorry, I didn't mean to flip you off. But I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know what your favorite jelly sandwich combinations are. They are endless. Like I said, all you need is a jelly polish and glitter. So there are thousands of combinations that you could come up with. I'm using Sations. It's all navy baby and this is a jelly polish and then I'm using KB Shimmers I got a crush on blue and this is of course my glittery polish so yeah I hope you guys enjoy I love you all and let's get on to the nails all right guys so I realized after doing this tutorial that using the dark colors it was kind of hard to see so if you guys want me to do another tutorial using lighter colors just let me know um, right now I had one coat of my jelly polish down I'm going in with my second coat as you can see you always want to start with two coats of your jelly polish just put that down make sure that you wrap your tip allow that to dry for I don't know like five minutes and then we're gonna go in with our glittery polish and you can always just leave it this way with the glitter on top and then just top coat it but when you put the second layer of your jelly polish down it makes the glitter look like it's just floating on your nail and it looks really cool so just put your glitter down allow it to dry for a few minutes and then we are going to go in with our final layer of our jelly polish hence the name jelly sandwich so just cover all that glitter up and the jelly polish is so sheer that it allows the glitter to peek through and it's not quite as intense as just wearing it by itself so it looks really really nice and there's so many combinations that you can do so just allow that to dry for about five minutes while I was waiting I went in and just did some cleanup if you guys have not seen my cleanup video I will link it down below and once we have everything nice and cleaned up we are going to go in with our favorite top coat I am using sesh feet of course it is the only top coat that I ever use but you can use whichever one you like and that's pretty much it I told you guys it was super simple so many combinations that you can do if you guys try this make sure you tag me on Instagram Twitter all those fun places and this is what it looks like I hope you guys enjoyed if you want another tutorial let me know I love you guys and I will see you next time bye Oh, I hate these things. But why? Excuse me while I adjust my wardrobe. Is there one over here? I always cut these out. How did I miss these mothers? Sorry. Okay, now I can film. Hi, guys. Whoa, yeah. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. No, that's really simple and... I'm out of breath. I don't know why I'm, I always get out of breath. Oh, and that blizzard that we were supposed to get, it's coming tonight. It's like, you can't promise me something and then take it away and make it another day. Weatherman. Sucker. Good news, though. Nobody's in my driveway right now. It's just me. Just me. I put them on right. I put them on correctly. But they still just feel like I have, like, two spiders sitting on my eyes. Just, um, and they, the spiders are holding knives and they're poking me. Alright, I'm leaving. I have some lashes to rip off. Ugh, that feels so good to just rip them off. No lashes, kids. Stay away from lashes. Stay lash-free. Oh, my mom bought me a large. And usually I'm a medium. Oh, and that's another thing. Don't you hate 
these YouTube girls, and they're like, I bought this in a zero, and it's like so big. Don't you just want to be like, shut up. Shut your dirty, stinking, skinny mouth and go eat a cheeseburger. I mean, does anybody else think that when you're watching a clothing haul, and they're like, oh my god, I bought this in extra small, but it's like so big. I could just reach through and just crunch, crunch their skinny little neck. This, uh, why are we talking, how do we even get on this subject? Oh, my shirt's too big. But it's not an extra small, and it's too big, it's a large. I need a medium. I am a normal person. I am not like, mm, mm. Can you tell them I'm better? Because I want, never mind, forget it. For freaking get it. Don't sass me, and don't tell me no. Forget it.